Audio Jungle. Hey guys, this is Jackie Black with Harry Robinson Buick GMC and it's Test Drive Tuesday. Today, we're gonna talk to you about uh, one of our last two remaining 2017 GMC Acadia Limited. We've got this one today in black. It does have custom pinstriping on the side. You'll notice the Limited exclusive wheels that are uh, only available on the Limited Acadia. But we're gonna talk about several different features today on this vehicle. Not only are we gonna talk about what we normally do when we drive around and show you all the features of the vehicle, we're also gonna talk to you about a couple things that you may or may not know this vehicle has to offer. So we're gonna walk around real quick. I'm gonna show you a couple things that I love about the Acadia. First one I wanna to talk to you about as we enter into the back row is the fact that, did you know on the GMC Acadia and the Enclave, the second row seat is actually adjustable. That means that this seat will move forward and backwards. What the benefit of that is going to be, since I personally can tell you, I've got a two-year-old and he's in a car seat. I also have a daughter that's almost 18 who's six foot tall. So if you're looking for a vehicle with great leg room, this is gonna be a good option for you. With the ability to move that second row forward and back, you can optimize where that seat ends in order to work for your day-to-day -day life. That means no more having your kids kicking you in the back, but you can still fit those long-legged teenagers in the third row. Speaking of the third row, I'm gonna walk you around here and show you exactly how easy it is to open that third row. As a mom, if you've got groceries with that easy press and open right there, you're talking about hands full, walking straight up and being able to put that down. Now, if you've got something you need to put in that's a little larger, the 60-40 split is a great feature because you can actually, with the pull of a quick handle, push those seats right down and they will fold completely flat. Of course, the adjustable seats got that one pulled back a little bit, so uh, it won't uh, go all the way down simply because we've got that seat on the right-hand side pulled down. But believe me, it does go completely flat to allow you to push anything you need in and out. With a simple push of a button here, that lift gate's back closed for you. Now, let's go ahead and jump inside the vehicle so I can show you some of the awesome technology available on this vehicle. This vehicle is equipped with remote start. That's gonna be located right here on the key fob. Just by a simple double click of the lock button and then one push and hold, I'm sorry, of the remote feature right here, this vehicle will actually start up for you and based on what you last had engaged, whether it be heat or air conditioning, it'll get that going for you as well. So in these cold days like today where it's below 40 degrees at this point, that's gonna be a feature you absolutely love. Now as I start the vehicle up, I've got my iPhone here in the vehicle with me. I wanna show you just how quick and easy it is to pair your phone up. So from your menu right here, you're just gonna go home, press the phone icon right there, Go to your settings icon on your phone, enter into your Bluetooth, press pair device, and within just a couple seconds you'll see I've already got the Acadia emblem, touch that, make sure that the numbers match, and if they do, you're going to say yes, pair, and just like that it says pairing successful. I'm going to allow it to sync my favorites, and all of my information as far as contacts goes is going to be loaded straight into the car that easy I've got full access to all my contacts from inside my vehicle. In choosing this vehicle I went ahead and had one of the tires uh, pulled up and deflated on this vehicle. The reason I wanted to do that is so that I could show you exactly what the tire pressure monitor is going to look like whenever that has been engaged. It's going to look just like this with a uh, U emblem underneath and an exclamation point inside. The reason I wanted to talk to you guys about this today is it's a great feature for many reasons. It's going to tell you if you have a tire that's outside, whether it be overinflated or underinflated, of General Motors recommended tire inflation. The reason they do that is so that if it comes outside of that, you know that you need to add or, re or remove air from your vehicle. This vehicle currently has air that is uh, needed in the vehicle, and the reason being is simply because when you have air, as everyone knows, it's just science. It can actually contract and expand. That air has, because of the cold weather, contracted, and therefore we're outside of those uh, standard limits on this vehicle. So, you have a couple options. You can pull into the service department, give us a call and let us know. We'll be happy to get those back to the recommended uh, inflation that they need to be, 
or what I would personally recommend and what I've done on my personal vehicle is come by and we can replace that air with a nitrogen gas. It's called Nitrofill and we'll be happy to do that for you at a very small charge and it comes with some great benefits like road hazard uh, in case you have an issue. The things that that's going to do for you, proper inflation is going to help with fuel mileage and prolong the life of your tires. So that's something I would strongly recommend you look into. All right, guys, we're talking about technology because we're in an Acadia Limited. So I wanted to show you just a couple of things that I get questions about in the sales department. The first one I'm gonna to talk to you about is this super cool feature. You'll notice we currently have the air conditioning set uh, to 74. As I stated, it was cold outside. What I wanna show you is that as I adjust this temperature, you're gonna notice the temperature on the other side adjusting as well. That's because of this sink feature. Now, if I move to my passenger side, my passenger, say he's a little warmer natured than me, can actually choose his very own temperature on the other side. This is called dual climate control. But this car is not going to stop there. It actually has tri-zone climate control, which means with the push of a button that states rear, we can actually push that. And all of a sudden you see these two controls are actually going to control the rear climate control. So I can now adjust pressing rear becomes that control. This one so that I can control the temperature in the back of the vehicle as well as the fan. So that's a great feature if you've got small kids or someone in the back that you want to make sure is staying warm. Or in my case, I put my son in in his jacket. He may be a little warmer than I am before I run him into daycare. That way I can keep his temperature where he doesn't get too hot in those situations. So that's a great thing about the tri-zone climate control that you're going to get in this Acadia Limited today. A couple other safety features. General Motors is always looking out for your safety. Because of those safety features, I wanted to show you just two things. You'll see these two icons located right here on this Limited. These features are going to be, the first one is going to be a lane departure warning. What that means is if for any reason you were to start to veer out of your lane while you're traveling and you have not turned on a turn signal, letting the vehicle know your lane departure is intentional, it's actually going to warn you with a beep and a light that's going to say, hey, you're veering out of your lane, you may want to pay attention. That's a great safety feature to keep you in your lane and safe. Now the next one is located right here. This is going to be frontal crash. When you press that icon, you can actually adjust how, how close you have to be to the vehicle in front of you in order for the vehicle to do a couple things. If you get close uh, to that vehicle, it's actually going to self-engage the brake for you, so it will bring you to a full stop, or it's, and in addition to that, uh, it's also going to let you know with a light that flashes as well as a uh, audible sound as well. So. This vehicle keeping you in your lane and at a safe distance from the person in front of you. Again, General Motors always looking out for you and your safety because that's the most important thing in their eyes. So as I can see, I'm running out of time, but this is a 2017 GMC Acadia Limited with lots of awesome features to keep you safe, keep your eyes on the road, your hands on the wheel. General Motors and Harry Robinson Buick GMC always thinking about the most important thing, which is you and your family's safety. All right, guys, as we stated, the 2017 GMC Acadia Limited. This has been your Test Drive Tuesday vehicle. With a thank you so much for watching another episode of Test Drive Tuesday. We'll look forward to seeing you to set up your test drive on this gorgeous vehicle.